Hi everybody, it's Tyson again, and uh, let's go see what's going on at the cafe this week, uh, the week of November the 16th. All right, so for our breakfast special, we have a three cheese omelet. Uh, that's gonna be three eggs, provolone, cheddar, and American cheese served with a side of tots. Uh, for our weekly special, we're gonna do a meatball hoagie. That's gonna be uh, pork meatballs, guys. Uh, marinara and provolone in a hoagie with your choice of side. For a special side this week, we have the pesto pasta salad. That's going to be spinach, tomatoes, and onions. Uh, sorry, spinach, tomato, onions, and parmesan with cavatappi noodles tossed in a pesto vinaigrette. All right. For our soups, Monday we have beef barley. Tuesday we have chicken dumpling. Wednesday we have broccoli cheese. Thursday we have tomato bisque. And Friday, we have the corn pepper bisque. Um, promotions this week, guys. Uh, come on down. Uh, premium teas of Peace Tea, as well as our Pure Leaf, are going to be buy one, get one, as well as our vitamin waters. So come on down. You know, quench your thirst. Uh, let's also remind you guys that uh, we got uh, snacks galore. Uh, candies galore, as well as other beverages for any of your cravings or uh, your quench, uh, thirst quenches, uh, as well as fresh salads. Uh, Friday is pizza day. As we all remember, build your own pizza. And just as a reminder, we do have a rustic crust pizza, the, the round uh, pizza crust, for just 50 cents more, if that's what you want. All you have to do is write it in on the notes on the pizza, uh, on the order form. Uh, as far as your food tip of the week, what to do with all your trims and scraps when you come with uh, vegetables, all right? Uh, like after you wash your vegetables and whatnot, including your onions, your potatoes, and, uh, and, and carrots and whatnot, uh, chefs like to actually keep them in a bag and freeze them. Uh, and then making sure they're thoroughly washed, uh, when we gather enough of them, we'll take it out of the freezer and make a uh, stock or broth out of it. Uh, stock and broths are great when you're making sauces. They're just overall good things uh, because you're going to discard them anyways. So why not get some use out of them? With that being said, and it getting colder, Making veggie stock is a good idea. Uh, veggie stock can easily replace uh, chicken broth or beef broth, uh, or at least help out with it. Let's say you don't have enough chicken broth in a recipe, add some of your veggie stock. And all you do is you literally throw it in a pot with some water uh, and the let it boil for like, I would say, about 45 minutes to an hour. Strain it, cool it down, and then whenever you need it, pull it out. It does have a one week shelf life, but you can also freeze it, uh, freeze the stock, and pull out what you need. Let's say you make a gallon and you know, just, just freeze like little containers at a time and grab what you need and put it out in the fridge. Trust me, this is a trick that, that, that a lot of chefs do because one, you are saving money, two, you're utilizing stuff that you normally wouldn't utilize, and three, stocks help add flavor in, uh, in replacement of what you normally do with water, all right, while cooking. So if you have any questions, please email me. Until uh, next time, guys, hopefully I see you at the cafe. Later.